absorb it on your, on your back again and it's learn with your brains and see your coin strategy of the town of Mexi from learn with your brain. And without wasting much time today I'm going to show you how some hackers or hackers use hash pasta to crack hashes in three seconds. It's going to be simple tutorial. So just follow along and let's get started. So uh, uh, what I'm going to show you is you're going to use some um, uh, different hashes algorithm to determine uh, the hash and it's going to crack a password or the hash itself okay so you know most uh, uh, companies or most websites use some hashes so that it will be difficult for to be able to password but this tool will help you crack this password which is being decoded uh, into hashes so seconds okay so I'm going to show you what we're going to use today today I'm going to use the sage security operating system which was made by myself okay so how to get the uh, sage operating system just open your web browser go to this site sage security OS mozilla.com okay so when you're here see sage I like I told you about that always my server scroll down it shows you uh, how to get it but you first need to install the chop box first then you click here to download the os and enter the user six and the password is t-o-r-r -R. okay so it's as simple as that and you go to services you see what all these things entail because it entails a whole lot of tools for your penetrating testing your security your cyber security and also so without wasting much of our time, I'm going to show you the two of them. So the tool will not get off. It was coded by one uh, media hacker. Okay, it's called some dev. Okay, so the tool is called Hash Buster. It was just updated just last month. So it's quite uh, impressive and we are on version 3.0. Okay, so the two I'm going to show you how to go about these two. So without wasting my time, I'll hit it sage operating system okay i'm here sage sage okay so to download this to all you need to do is to uh, type git clone okay then after that you come to your web browser click on this screen uh, icon here get a drop down list then this is the link copy this link and paste it right here okay but because i've already uh, downloaded it i don't need to download it again because if i type http okay yes i think for slash github slash s Zero is not O. Zero M E three V slash hash pasta dot get. But it's in feta destination part hash pasta already exists. It's not an empty directory. Okay, that means I've already downloaded it. So I'm going to show you how to use the tool. So let's clear here. The screen when I list this hash past perfect. So I need to what, navigate to this folder. So I'll use the change directory CD to change the directory to hash master by hitting the tab to automatically complete this uh, word I'm looking for. Okay, let's hit enter list what is into the file. So now to toss code in Python 3. So to run this program, you need to type Python 3 HAS tab complete and perfect. You see, hash pasta version 3.0 already in our So now we are going to start how to use this uh, application to crack in the hash within 3 seconds. So in cracking, this we use this term buster okay which is part of the hash buster crack the hashes so to crack it you just need to type buster 
Now I'm going to show you some help menu of these so that you'll be able to use the correct flags when you are cutting the hashes. So pass the minus H when you hit enter what you find is optional argument. So when coding this application you use what is what uh, argument to represent okay so these are kind of flags and the argument is shown here so minus H as I show you I just type by stem minus it and it's going to show you this help message and exit. Okay, so this minus each flag here is to show us what the help menu of this application. Okay, minus s means the hash. So to crack a hash, you just use the minus s flag before you place your hash there. F is a file, file containing hashes. So you can create a file full of hashes and use the minus. F lab to grab those ashes in the file. And it is directly containing ashes. So with this D, it navigates through what you put the path and or the folder which contains the file. The file which contains ashes, you use the minus D flag to do this process. The minus D is the number of threads you want the application to run, whether 100 per thread per second or 200 per second. Okay. I hope you've understand all this explanation. So to crack the hash, this is what we are going to do. We are going to do this L because we are working with a single hash. And let me show you how it works. Let me clear the screen so that we get some space to do what we want to do. So to crack it, I told you we are going to use the minus S plan, so we just type it faster. Minus S. Okay. So that you see what we do. Make extend this. Perfect. Now, when I open my Firefox browser, I've already opened a page. This is tunips.com, which has some example of hash input. I look at the algorithm which is used to uh, uh, generate all these hashes. Okay, so MD5 SHA, SHA 253 decrypt, MD5 crypt. So all I need to do is to copy this hash. I look at what the two is going to do. I'll copy this hash. Okay. Go back to my terminal. Basta minus. I switch in the flag for hashes. Then I paste this code here. If you look at what is going to happen, when I hit enter, see hash basta. It detected that the hash function is on MD5. So when we go back to our page, now you could see MD5. This two was able to detect that the hashes of MD5 and the path and the hashes. So this hash will be the S password. So instead of the person trying to type password for people to see, they try to convert this password to this hash, making it difficult for people to know exactly what this entails. Okay. So let's use the same. This is a SHA one. Let's copy this. Okay. Let's try to copy. Copy this hash. But it's using another function. Okay. When you copy this, and I run the basta again, let me clear this hash. We know it's MD5. And paste this hash. He detected that it's of a SHA 1. So when they come here, SHA 1. When they come down, you see, it also cried that this is of password, the same thing. But it's the same password, 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 by the different algorithm function, of uh, encrypted functions to generate all these kind of patches. So I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. And I know by now you'll be able to know how we kind of these tools to crack hashes within three minutes so you see when we pasted this hash it crack what is this hash in just even one second not even up to three seconds
password as well. If it is a website you are logging in which has hashes, now you see you'll be able to track the hash. The second. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Hit the subscribe button from now because i told you i had some challenges but now it's being solved i'm going to upload more videos as usual so take care it's to your co-instructor dr don from learning to brains enjoy your day and see you in the next tutorial goodbye